right now, you can't even study history on racism. Yeah? Yeah? It, you know, in, when I went to college, it was a subject. A subject where you'd study all races and their cultural differences and how those made all kinds of problems in people or benefits in people, all the things that come from it. It's a theory process. What is the theory behind why are we racist? What, what makes that happen? Yeah? And that's the principle behind the theory of racism. Yeah? And now, because people, you know, are dumb, dumber than dumb, yeah, they, their process of understanding any of it, it leads them to think, well, no, now they're going to go against all black people. Yeah? It's all about, no, we don't want teaching about black people, the history of black people, or the history of communism, or the history of socialism, or the history of this country or another country. Yeah? But if you don't get that, you're not going to learn what I'm just telling you. Yeah? You're not going to learn that all of that stuff is dying out. Yeah? Putting people into prison and then shooting that person and killing people, you know, for any reason whatsoever in a prison is not something that happens in the world. It only happens in the most evil countries. Very few. And our country is included in that. Yeah? Our last president shot off and killed as many people as he could in the last month of his office. He killed people. He specifically said, I want people killed, hung, I want them shot, I want them, you know, drugs put in them, I want them killed. And I want that to happen while I'm on the watch. Yeah? Because it hasn't happened for 30 years. Some states it hasn't happened for 100 years. But he pushed and pushed and pushed and pushed and pushed to have large numbers of people daily be killed. Yeah? Because he felt that was necessary in the element of judgment. Unless you go to that evil level of judgment, you'll never get anybody to be afraid. You have to do that sort of thing. Yeah. That's how crazy. That is not in the rest of the world. 